Hello, brother. Today our topic is the phase difference. The sensorial wave form sine wave can be presented the graphically in the time domain along an horizontal zero axis, and that since sine wave have a positive maximum value at a time, a negative maximum value at the three lambda by two with a zero value occurring along the baseline at a zero to infinity to infinity however not however not all the sensorial waveforms will pass the exactly through the zero axis point at the same time but may be shifted to the right of the left of a zero angle some value when compared to another sine wave for example comparing the voltage waveform to that of the current waveform this then produce an irregular shift of a phase difference between the two sensorial waveform any sine wave that does not passes through the zero at the t is equal zero has phase shifted phase is shifted the phase difference are a phase shifted is it is also called of a sensorial waveform is an angle of theta greek letter p p in a degree or a radius that the waveform has been shifted from a certain reference point along the horizontal zero axis in other word the phase shift is the lateral difference between the two or a more waveform along a common axis or a sensorial waveform of the same frequency can have the phase difference the phase difference or a phi or a theta of an alternating waveform can vary from between 0 to the maximum time period t or a maximum during a one complete cycle of a this can be anywhere along the horizontal axis between the theta is equal 0 to the two lambda radius or a 360 depend upon the irregular unit use the phase difference can be also expressed as a time shifted of a t is a time period or a t for example of a 10 mm s or a 5 us but in general it is a more common express phase different as in a angular measurement then the then the equation of a instantaneous value of a sensorial voltage or a current waveform we developed in the previous sensorial waveform will need to modify to take the account of a phase angle of a waveform this new general expression becomes phase difference is equal to a a a little t means a for a time is equal to a maximum multiplied by the sine lambda plus minus 2 axis where the am is the amplitude of a waveform vt is the angular frequency regular frequency of a waveform in a radius per second phi or theta is the phase angle degree or a radius that has the wave of a shifted waveform has been shifted either the left or the right from a reference point here is a picture of that phase difference phase relation of a sensorial waves in a phase here is the theta a is equal to the sine and frequency and also is shown in another one picture is a positive and also shows in
in a negative mood. Firstly, let the consider that the two alternative quantities such as the voltage in and the current I have a same frequency of a hertz as the frequency of a two quantities is the same angular velocity must also be the same so any intense in a time we can say that the phase of a voltage will be the same in the phase in the current then the angle of a rotation within a particular time period will be always be the same and the phase difference between the two quantities of a V and I therefore be a zero. As the frequency of a voltage the current I are the same must be the both which is their maximum positive negative and the zero value during one complete cycle of the same time although their amplitude may be different. Then the two alternating quantity V is equal V and I are the said to be in a phase. I think I have clearly defined about the application and what is the phase difference between the phase and I have clearly about declared in a picture frequency and what is the time period relation in a phase difference. Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe my channel. Still not subscribed yet. Thank you.